for our next question in collision of particle, we have this question over here. Uh, let me zoom in. So now in question five of tutorial ten, we have this uh, a one point five kg sphere A is released from rest when uh, theta A is forty five degrees. Okay, as shown in this diagram, and strikes a three kg sphere B which is at rest. Knowing that the coefficient of restitution is E equals to 0 0.75, determine the values of theta A and theta B corresponding to the highest position to which the spheres would rise after impact. Alright, so over here we can derive some uh, conservation of energy. So we know that gravitational potential energy must be conserved in the kinetic energy when it strikes. So mgh equals to half mv squared. Uh, I cancel m from both sides and I know that v1a is equal to square root of 2gh. All right. So what is H? So um, to know what is H, we set the reference point over here as zero. So H is between. Uh, let me just put this down. Huh? So. So this is the reference point of zero. Okay. Yeah. So that's the reference point of zero between this line and this line. There'll be H. So how do we know this distance? We know that. This length is L, see? This is a L and it's a circular arc, right? So over here would be L as well. Now we need to find this red color line. And that would be L cosine 45. Therefore, H is equals to L minus L cosine 45. And then we sub this H into this square root 2 GH. And this is what we get. So V1A is equals to 0 0.7654 square root GL. And the moment when they have the impact, Conservation of linear momentum uh, will be along the asset will be along the x-axis. Hence we write this down. MAVA1 equals uh, plus MBVB1 equals to MAVA2 plus MBVB2. We know that velocity of B is actually zero in the beginning, hence it's zero over here. Okay? VA1 is uh, what we have calculated over here. Mass of A is given. So over here. Mass of A is given, but mass of uh, velocity of A2 is not given, velocity of B2 is not given. So, currently we got two unknowns. Not to worry, we can use restitution equation. So, VA2 minus VB2 equals to negative EVA1 minus VB1. So, we put down whatever that we have. Similarly, we still don't have VA2 and VB2, but I have uh, everything else, VA1. And then we just simplify the whole equation to be something like this so I just bring over VB2 over the other side and especially in terms of VA2 and why is this so is I'm gonna bring this over here see so this VA2 this entire length will be brought into here okay that's why you see over here okay so what I'm doing here is I'm trying to make one unknown only so over here there's two equations two unknowns so I'm trying to find what's VB2 very easily, I know what's VB2. Okay? And of course, once we know VB2, we can also find out what's VA2 as well. Okay? And why is that so? Because VA2 is equal to these numbers plus VB2. So VB2, just plug it over here. Okay? That's why we got VA2 like this. Next, we use conservation of energy. So after they strike, they have to rise to a certain height. So the certain height will be HA for particle A, okay? So uh, gravitational potential energy will be equals to the kinetic energy. So because we know what's VA2 already, which is calculated over here, so we just bring it up here, simplify the whole equation, and then you can express HA equals to this equation. Okay? So what is HA? HA is uh is the height where you rise after impact. So what's the height that will rise will be L minus L cosine the theta of A. Okay? So once you once reach over here we express it in terms of theta of A will be R cosine of 1 minus H A over L. Okay? So what's H A? H A is over here. So we sub this whole thing into this H A, simplify the whole equation. Now you see there's L, L and L, so we just cancel the L's and we just use up cosine, uh, basically cosine inverse 1 minus this number and we get this uh, angle. Okay? So you do the same thing for HB. So conservation of energy, 
our gravitational potential energy equals to the kinetic energy using the same steps we can find what's theta of b so that's how you do tutorial 10 question 5